Hi, my name is Lisa. I'm a solutions engineer at Verkata, and this tutorial will cover how to set up your command account. The first time you log into command, your administrator will send you an automated email to join the organization. First thing I will need to do is go to my email and look for that. If you did not receive it, be sure to check your junk or spam folders before asking your administrator to go into your account and resend it. When I open up this email, I can see that my coworker John Smith has invited me to join Organization ABC Corp. This email will give me a one-time sign-in link to create my account. Note that the link is set to expire after 30 days. Clicking this link will bring up a new browser tab where I can create my user account. I will have to enter my first and last name, and although I don't have to put my phone number in if I don't want to, this time I will. I will also create my password. Verkata requires your password to have at least eight characters, contain one number, and at least one special character. Once I do that, I'm officially logged into command. Here I will be able to see all of the devices that I have permission to view based on what my administrator has set for my profile. To log out, I will go to the organization button in the bottom left corner of the page and select log out under my email. If I am logged out and I want to log back in, all I need to do is go to command.vercata.com and select the option on the right to log into Vercata. After I add my email, I can either log in manually by typing in my password, or I can get a magic link sent to me. This feature is great because sometimes I forget my password, so instead of going through the process to reset it, I can click this button, check my email, and click a link that will automatically log me in. Now that I'm back in command, let me quickly show you how to navigate the platform. The waffle in the upper left corner is used to toggle between product lines, as well as important organization-wide settings like our admin and devices pages. When I select a product line, the left sidebar will change to reflect product-specific settings. For cameras, these are settings like grids, archives, people analytics, and so on. Lastly, I'd like to make my account more secure by enabling two-factor authentication. To do this, I need to access my account settings, which can be found by clicking on the organization icon on the bottom left corner and selecting account settings underneath my email address. Here I can click on enable 2FA, which will prompt me to retype my password. Once I've done this, I can now use SMS texting or an authenticator app to enable the second level of authentication in order to log in. That's all for this video. Thank you so much for watching. As always, don't forget to visit help.vercata.com to view our many knowledge base articles and know that our 24-7 support team is always available for further help and questions.